And we're just hours away from SpaceX taking a crucial step needed to put astronauts into space, but now weather could mm. be a factor. This is News 6 at 11, getting results. I'm Matt Austin. And I'm Ginger Gadsden. Right now, SpaceX says they are watching the wind ahead of tomorrow morning's launch. Chief Meteorologist Tom Sorrells is standing by with the weather changes happening overnight on the coast. But we start with News 6's Eric Sandoval at Cape Canaveral with the critical test in the race to space. There is a lot riding on this launch. This is the final step SpaceX has in certifying its Dragon capsule for humans to go to space in. And here at Jetty Park, people from all over came here to see it happen. Ignition, lift off. SpaceX says Saturday's test is designed to see if astronauts could be safely rescued if something catastrophic happened during launch. They released this video showing what should happen. They say the Falcon 9 will lift off between 8 a.m. and noon from launch pad 39A. 84 seconds in and over the ocean, SpaceX says they will trigger the abort system. They say there could be an explosion as a result that could be seen from Earth. They say the plan then calls for the Dragon capsule to parachute into the Atlantic. This is bonus. So we're all excited. Effie Moore is from Nova Scotia, Canada. She and her friends from Chicago have watched launches at Jetty Park before. Just seeing, I mean, the launches themselves are just spectacular. So we can't really imagine what's going to happen. Fresh Brevard County, Cape Canaveral water. As the launch gets closer, more people arrived. <laughs> this time, some of them put up caution tape to make sure no cars ruin their view because they say this launch is going to be something special. This is the last test, mm -hmm. and then after that, it's like, the sky's the limit. Well, that was good. That was good. Now, that launch window opens at 8 a.m., but SpaceX thinks the Falcon 9 may not lift off until later on in that four-hour launch window. They said they need the ocean conditions to be calm in order to go out and retrieve that Dragon capsule. We're in Cape Canaveral. Eric Sandoval getting results. News 6.